What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Wanna Hill Farms. We're sorry we haven't been posting in the last two weeks. We've had a lot to do with school and other stuff like that, but we're back and we're gonna be posting videos for you guys. In today's video, I have sidewalk chalk here, and I'm gonna show that to you in a second. Sidewalk chalk, and I'm gonna be crushing it up and making a fishing lure out of it. So here's my chalk. It's really old and it's been used, but I'm gonna pick a couple colors to use. So that one right here, it's like green and orange. So I'm gonna use that one. And there's a purple, I might use it. And I might go with this yellow one right here. So those are the three I'm gonna be using right there. All right, so those are the three I'll be using. I'll catch y'all tomorrow when I'm about to start to make them. All right, guys. It is the next day. I am going to be making the lures today. I did a trial run last night just to see how it turned out with the green and orange, and it turned out pretty good. Let's see here. That's what it looks like. So hopefully we can get colors like that today. Um, since I did the blue or the um, green and orange, I am going to be using this one. It is yellow and blue. So I'm gonna be using that one. Still got the regular yellow. I might change that out because I do have the yellow. I do have the purple for sure. So I'm going to, I'm, I'm probably going to change this one out. So I'll let you know if I do that. Stay tuned. Okay, you guys, I did change it out. I have this orangey yellow type color. I'm using that. So let's get started to make them. All right, you guys, I do have my first color right here. I'm going to be doing yellow and blue. So I just had this little container. I have a rock that I'm gonna hit it with to get the dust. So I'm gonna show you all that. All you gotta do is hit it. As you can see, all that dust is flying off. So I'm gonna be keep doing that and I'll let y'all know when I'm done. All right, guys, I have done a lot. That's a good bit of powder. See the rock, I just chills it away with it. That's the remaining chalk. I might need it if needed, but but right now I'm gonna try this and I'm about to start making it. Okay, you guys, so I'm ready. I got my plastic and my measuring cup. Um, Here's the chalk powder. Got my mold injector and eyes. Everything's ready. So I think what it is that makes it the tint, as you've seen in the Kool-Aid video, is hardened. So I'm not gonna put hardener in this one, but I am gonna put just a little salt. So when I make a video on fishing these, there will be, um, they will sink. So I'm gonna just toss a little in there. Not much, that should be enough. Okay, now I'm gonna put it in my microwave. So let's get it in there. I think I'm probably gonna do about two minutes and 50 seconds. Right, let's do two minutes. All right, so that's gonna get in there and we'll let y'all know I'm doing. Okay, you guys. Got about, let's see, two, five. All right, we're ready. Still got that small tent. I don't think it'll make it decent. Yeah, it's not gonna make it That's all right. Okay. And got my clear pass chalk. And if y'all wanna see me do a clear lure challenge, make some clear um, baits and try them out, Comment down below. I'm gonna put our stuff in there. Two and a half, and I'm gonna start to see what it looks like. All right, so blue and green do make, or blue and yellow do make green. So that looks like what we got here. That's a good color. Might add a little flake to it, actually. I'm um, probably 
not that bubbly. It does have some bubbles. Not as much as I was thinking. I give uh, World's Worst Fishing the credit to this video coming up with the idea. But I think I'm ready to inject, so let me get my clamps. I do think this is going to be a cool color. That looks really good. And you know the clumps. I can really the color right here. Check that out. There's like little pieces which kind of imitates the flake a little bit. But um, this is a really good color. And if anything else that y'all want to see in this um, I'll make anything. Just uh, drop a comment down below, like and subscribe, and anything you want to see, just comment down below and I'll be sure to try my best to find it. Alright, we'll pick up the camera. Alright you guys, here we go. Take the clamps off the hole. Ooh, that's hot. Ooh, I'll break myself. All right, there's our chalk. So I don't chalk with it. That is like an amazing color. I love that color. Here it is. All right, I'm gonna put my in my water right here. I'm gonna make another one. I'm gonna add flake this time. So I'm thinking I'm gonna add flake. I have purple. I think I might do some purple. Let's do purple. This is just Little Works grape flake. And this is heat resistant, so it can get hot. Can't want to burn your plastic saw or anything. The glue work is the best for you to buy with um, molds and everything. So I'm gonna stir this stuff in right here. Oh yeah, that's really good. That's really good. I'm kind of changing the color a little bit too. Okay. Uh -huh, I'm gonna throw that back in there. This stuff does. Um, Remelt pretty good, so that's always a plus when you can always remelt it. So, let's take all this stuff off. Alright, this is a good color, I like this color. Alright, let's put that back in the microwave for probably about a minute and a half. And I'll pick up the camera when it's ready. All right, you guys. Got yeah, one. Seven seconds left. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it and get All right. So this is with purple flakes. So that's a nice color. I can tell we're hot enough because we're all steam. So let's go ahead and inject it. So I am starting to see signs of a darker green compared to the last one, which I mean is always a good thing. I think the purple flake kind of made it a little better, in my opinion. So I am actually going to make a couple more of these, and I will show you all the finished product. All right, you guys. So I went ahead and did a couple more. As you can see, I have four. This is the first one that we did. As you can see, the yellow see the yellow and the blue this one there's one with silver flake and i did a couple more of those 
So yeah, um, I'd have to say out of my favorites, I kind of like the green because it just, it imitates the lizard the best. Um, but you know, the purple flake, you can't go wrong with that. Cause it'll still shine in the water and I'm sure a bass will bite any one of these. So I'm gonna get started crushing up the next color. So stay tuned. All right, you guys, I have them sitting in the salt right here next to me. And I'm gonna show you all a close up of them. All right, so the lighter one, the one on my right is the one that we did first with no flake. You see the little dots of the specks. And then that's the one with the black flake. It looks really good, but if I had to say my favorite, I would probably say the one that we did first, just because it just imitates the lizard better. But they're both good colors. I'm gonna get next ready to, for the next one. All right, you guys. So I'm going on to the next color, but I was thinking, y'all know me and Boone's favorite team is Clemson. So I gotta go orange and purple together. So I'm gonna do orange and purple together and I'm gonna crush them up. I'll let y'all know when it's ready to go in the plastic. All right, you guys. So I have the orange and purple here. And I've been scraping for a little while, but I'm gonna show y'all what I'm doing. Um, this is a longer way of doing things, but it's also a better way. Because if you scrape it like this, you're not getting those big clumps in there. And it's easier to mash up. So I'm just scraping it like this against the rock, as you can see. Keep doing this, keep doing this, keep doing this. It's just falling in my bucket. I think I'm gonna call this the CU special. And then I think I'm gonna call the other one the sidewalk special. Right, so as you can see, I'm just scraping. It beats like having to beat it like this and then clump getting in there and then you have to go back and do it. So it just beats doing that. But this is what I'm doing and I just wanted to show y'all that. All right guys, so we have the orange, purple, AKA Clemson special right here. So got my plastic, um, as last time, throw a little salt, maybe a little hardener, cause coming out of those molds, the other ones, they were just a little, um, a little softer than I'd want them to be. And I don't really, I mean, they're great colors and I don't want them to break off after I catch like one bass. So I'm just put a little, so these will be a little firmer, but um, I gotta give it a quick stir. Get all this off my rice and rice. I'm gonna clean my table off. All right, so I'm gonna. Like I said, if y'all want me to do the clear lure challenge, please make a comment down below saying you would or you wouldn't. In a couple weeks, maybe a couple days, I am gonna go fishing with these. Um, as you saw in the last video that I was fishing with my lures, I caught my eight pound bass. Hopefully I can catch a 10 pound with these. But um, when this is ready, I'll let y'all know what I'm about to put in. We can see some orange and purple. Yeah. All right, so it has a big air bubble in it. Let me check my legs and another one of these. Just got a big kind of thing on it. There's no color in the tail. I like that color. Um, here it is. So I'm really gonna put it in the water over here. I'm gonna make another one right quick for you guys. Alright, 
So instead of the clips and special, that looks nothing like orange or purple. I think I'm gonna call this like. Hmm. Okay. This one. Color matches the color of the sidewalk almost. So I'm gonna call this sidewalk special. Change the color of that one. I don't know. Y'all leave a comment on what I should call call it. Still hot. I'm gonna clean my motor out. Clean the injector out. And when that's ready, we'll get back to go. Hey, check that out. All right, you guys. We got about three seconds left. All right, we're ready. So let's get rolling. We did get that color to it. Nothing bad. We learned from the last one we mixed it up and it still made an amazing color. So, let's get ready to put our function thing in. I feel like it's going to be a little more puffy because I didn't have any purple salt in here. And I'll do orange. I want to do like a spices video making them. I want to do all types of videos for you guys. I just want you to know what y'all want me to do. Right, so, get my right, so that's the bubbles right there. That's all bubbles. That was two different brands of chalk. I don't know if that has an impact on what is going on. Uh, so just for a little more coloring, I'm gonna dump the rest of this stuff in there. Just because I do want to use balls as it can get. So it's gonna be like a purple. Just stand in it. Okay, so, all right, this is weird. That's starting to rise. And this is all the bubbles. Let's get it stirred up. That was weird. I was waiting for it to pop out. So we have some layering of colors. There. It's like a green, I guess. Ooh, all the orange and purple. I think I'm gonna do the same deal as last time. The first time I'm not gonna put flake. Then the second time I am. Okay, so I'm still not hot enough. I'm Not have been the best because it was a little airy. That color, not the biggest fan of it, but I mean, it'll do, I guess. Kind of like a clear almost. This is what I did last night with that orange and blue chalk that I saw at the beginning. So, right here, you can see some little bits in it orange and blue. So, it made green, but um. It didn't turn out well. I was going to film it. Didn't turn out the best. I just decided I'll pick another color and I'll just do that. But I really do like that color better. Which I mean, I can barely tell the difference between them. But it's a little different. I like it better. Okay, so I think everything is ready in here. If y'all haven't already, please subscribe. I'm trying to get to 200 subs. And the molder here. Cloudy Sky is another color I like um, for this one. So here we go. All right, that one looks much better than the last one does. So let's keep 
Mm. Getting a Cinco mold later this month. I'm gonna be making some of those for y'all when I get it. But y'all can still see pieces. The arms kind of turned a little gray. So that might have been what it was. You can see the purple right there on the tails, please. But here they are. I'm gonna put it in the water. Thank you for watching. Hope you liked the video. Please like and subscribe if you have not already. Comment down below more ideas you want me to do. And we'll see y'all in the next video.